buckle up now for a culinary trip around the world with delicious and global recipes from the new cookbook, Eating From Our Roots. That's right. She says it's time to cut back on the processed ingredients and get back to some good old traditional cooking. Please welcome registered dietitian and nutritionist, Maya Fowler. Maya! Now, Maya, I have to warn you, everyone here gives me a hard time. I'm not the best cook. Yeah, because there are only him. two of us up here. All right, that can well, cook. I'm going to get you involved. Okay, okay. so we're going to start with the marinade for this is a peri peri chicken. And I'm going to actually, you can you put this in here? And you're going to do all this? All of it? Yeah, all <laughs> okay. of it. Okay. Yeah, you're going to just go ahead and dump them right on in. So, all we have here all the different spices for this version of peri peri chicken that has been inspired by Portuguese flavors. You see, I have you doing all the work while mm -hmm. I chit chat? Yeah. Mm -hmm, that's right. She's so, teaching me. I'm and teaching the Portuguese you. Portuguese flavor. Yes. And so so okay. it's interesting, those flavors actually came up to Portugal through colonization by Mozambique and Angola. And so there's a little bit of heat on this, but it's a little bit milder than like the African versions. Okay. This too? Yes, this All as well. It. Yep, go ahead, okay. right in there. So See? that's gonna go in so there. Probably. Turn this on for one hot second. <laughs> Yes. All right. And then this is what you get. Ooh. Now I'm going to have you, Demarco, come okay. on over here and give me a Move hand with this. Move on out the way. Move on out the way. So Let a real cook over here. Yes. Trust me get in the there. <laughs> so you're, what you're going to do is you're going to brush that marinade onto the chicken that has been cut down the middle. Okay. Don't get it everywhere, over yeah. every hey. single nook and cranny Gotta and crevice. Get into it. So the, this, we're going to leave in the fridge and you're going to let that marinate for 24 hours. This will be the end result that you're going to go ahead and put into your oven. What if you don't have 24 hours? What if you're, you're short on time? I would say that, you know, you need at least 30 minutes to let those flavors come together. This is going to be hot but not too spicy Ooh, and it smells very good. very it smell I know right it smells really good. so this is just I mean I love it when I was making this with chef Sylvia Barbon who was the cook that helped me mm -hmm. the chef oh my goodness when it came out of the oven we were literally licking our fingers on this sheet pan not this one in particular but the one in my <laughs> kitchen like, uh, uh, you're like uh, -uh. <laughs> but let me tell you it was amazing like the flavors are unbelievable so it's a, it's a dish that That's I love, and it's also look pretty. Too. You're, you know you're so professional. I mean, look. You are Can so you professional. You know? Gorgeous. Hey. Gorgeous. Hey. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Give you a round of applause. So yeah, so that's what you're going to get after 24 hours. Next, you're back up again. Okay. This is going to be the dressing for the salad. So pour all of these yes. in here. Okay. So what we have is a little bit of oil. We've got some chives. We have some dill. What is we this have, right here? Yeah, so this is the, um, so we have a little bit of lemon juice mm. in there, and mm -hmm. it's going to be amazing. It's a green herbaceous dressing. Ooh. So while you're doing that, I'm actually going to dress this salad over here. Do you this like is, fresh herbs then? So I love a combination of fresh and dry. The truth is whatever you have access to is kind of what I tell people to go ahead and purchase. Mm. You also want to purchase your herbs based on your individual flavor profile. Okay. So if you're not a person who loves ginger, garlic, and onion, modify. Make those changes based on what you like. The key is to really eat the foods that you love, but I want you to have some plants in that meal and that mix as well. Right? So here we go. This is our salad. Do Ooh, you want to taste it? That looks good. Very good. Yes. Yeah. All right. Yeah, right. stick your here. finger in there. So this okay. is what the dish looks like when it's done. We've got our dressed salad and our peri peri chicken that has mm. been lovely roasted. Mm. This all tastes so fresh. It it's does. delicious. Thank it's you so much, it. Maya, for joining us today and also, of course, for today's recipe. It's delicious. Go to goodmorningamerica.com slash food or you can scan the QR code right there on your screen with your phone. It's Good very to see easy you, Maya. To Thanks, Thanks for, for having me. Of course. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.